How is everybody this morning? Happy Thursday. Yay. Yay. It feels like the weekend. We're just happy, getting going. Happy uh, pre-holiday weekend. Yes. I feel short. I, might. I can bring it down. I was going to say, maybe I need a booster seat. Uh -huh. I think I'm shrinking. <laughs> As you know, I, I switched our background to Christmas. Yeah, Christmas um, in July. Because we're kicking it, that off in July. Yeah. So just getting ready for all that. I, I was just telling Emmy this morning, um, I picked up a couple new uh, Christmas patterns. Yeah. Not that I need any new starts, but uh -huh. hey, you know what? <laughs> yes. Why not? <laughs> so, but I, I think I'm going to dig out some of my Christmas nice. things to start to work on just in July. So, yeah, but. I've thought about it. I don't actually have that many Christmas whips, so we'll see. I haven't yeah. decided. I started that little, uh, the tiny town Christmas one oh, at Christmas. Okay. And so I'm going to, I'm going to get that out yeah. and, and work on it. But I do have a handful of other ones that I think I'll nice. get out. And, and that, so. So I think my Christmas I have is, like, all of Lindsay's charts, I want to say, is all I have kitted. Like, her Merry Christmas with the gingerbread. Um, oh, what else? The Jolly Happy Soul mm -hmm. I have kitted, which that was in a sip, a, a sip and stitch. Yeah. And I swear there's one more. Oh, yeah. and her alphabet, her Christmas alphabet. Yeah. So those are... On my list yeah. to get done. Good morning, everybody. Man, there is so many. Thank you for hopping yeah, on. Yeah, thank we're just, you. It's, it's, we have uh, a lot to share, so I want to make sure everyone's here because yeah, there's so we, much fun We've got stuff. a lot of fun things to share. Um, the ladies in the shop have just been rocking yes. it. They, Man, the orders have been going out and yeah. everything. Um, we uh, hired a new gal a couple yes. months ago. And it's funny because her name is Lindsay also, but yes. it's spelled a little different. So we have two employees that are Lindsay and two employees that are Emily. Emily. So, so we, it's, it gets it's, a little confusing we, up in here. It's a little confusing, but oh man. It's always like Lindsay and everyone's like, what? And then Emily and I was like, what? what? <laughs> but um, it's kind of funny. I have to say they've all just yeah. rocked it, everybody. Yeah. And um, we're going to be sad when all school starts back up and all the younger kids are going to yes. go back to school. But but um kudos yeah. to everybody that's been helping here in the shop yes. and um and then also you guys out there are just amazing yes, and so oh thank you everyone uh, thanks yeah. for joining so as you guys know we usually have a newsletter on stitching on thursday mornings and then quiltings are friday morning mm -hmm. make sure you're subscribed because that's going to be where you see everything first in our shop yep. that is released. And um, you can join both of them because each yeah, of them are different. Yeah, I would join different. both. Make sure you subscribe to both. One's geared for our stitchers, one's for our quilters. Oh, oh Debbie. Thanks, Debbie. Thank you. Oh, How are you? You're so sweet. Thank you. Thank it's you so much. good to see you here, Debbie. <laughs> <laughs> I see your orders all the time. <laughs> I know I'm actually kind of... We're, we have... Um, you know, Lindsay and Emily are two, like, girls right now and that are, like, kind of taking over the role that I've had and I've been training them and it's been hard for me to delegate, I'm not going to lie to you guys, <laughs> and let go of things so I can be better use in other areas of work and they have just done so good and I'm so excited because yeah. I think it's going to make everything for work flow so good and obviously our other employees are awesome and they're yeah. more of the shippers but it's been interesting letting go of certain things and just like okay we're growing we have to let this go in order for us to keep growing yeah. and make things work and smoothly there's just so it's been really good it's, like yeah so this week has gone really well and getting those girls trained and it's just ex exciting because it's like this changes come and it's just so fun. And yeah. I think I'm just really excited to see how we yeah. evolve more and grow. It's just crazy. Yeah, it, it is. It's, <laughs> it is crazy how much we've grown. And, yeah. and um, 
It's been it's it, exciting. It just, it's exciting yeah. and scary. And I'm so thankful. And, like I was talking while Katie was here. Oh, thank oh, you, thank Valeria. Thank you, Valeria. Good you're to so see you sweet. too. It's good to see you. See your orders all. I it's like everyone I know, and I see your names. And <laughs> um, I was talking to Katie about it because she was here, you know. And I was just like, I'm just so thankful. Like, it's just crazy the reach we've had, and like all of you guys, and like yeah. the influence that we have created. And I told her, I was like, it feels like we've done this by accident. And I'm like, <laughs> this is just crazy. Like, I literally was in awe the other day of, like, yeah. where we are and what we do. And just, well, I'm just, like, blown away. It, <laughs> like, it's, it's weird because, like, um, I was talking to my good friend. And I yeah. says, you know, when me and Lindsay started this over seven years ago, um, it was just me and her. Yeah. And, and would we thought. would just throw each... Yeah, you know our thoughts on each other and mm -hmm. do that and stuff and then you know slowly we brought on each of the girls and and, and now it's like yeah and, and employees and yeah and stuff and so now and just it's like different insane. it's where we started with long arm quilting and to see where we are because like Lindsay, our employee was she actually asked me yesterday and she's like can you tell me your story like how did this all become and i was yeah. like dude by accident like this yeah. like <laughs> we were so lucky and it's just yeah. been a lot lately and i'm like well, We're and, so lucky. And I, I, I <laughs> like, think what's happened, too, is what we've grown from. And to see, yeah. um, well, like, uh, all of you girls grow in, yeah. in your designing uh, minds. Well, not even design, everything. but growing and as growing, people. And, exactly. Um, I think yeah. all of us have. And learning, we've learned so much lately. And it's forced us to grow. It's yeah. like that uncomfortable feeling. But it's been good like yeah. and it just hit me the other day like yeah. I was like wow we're so lucky that, oh and believe me yeah. we have our ups and downs <laughs> oh yeah and, it's, and that's life everyone yeah. has ups and downs and ebbs and flows hills and valleys and yeah it's been just like I just lately I'm like man I just want to sit in the gratitude right now because I feel so lucky that I finally have um employees that I like can delegate to so well, I can give I more like to they, you guys so. I also feel like that ones that care that yeah. have oh, that yeah. interest um because you can get employees that it's just a job oh yeah and stuff and so. oh man I just feel like that the ones that we have right we've now we've just gotten a good crew we've going. got a good crew yes. going it's and exciting. it is very exciting so so I just yeah I'm excited yeah. and I um, Lindsay is on vacation and Katie's on vacation. So Lindsay left for Florida to go hang out with Alicia, the fanciful flamingo. Katie went to California with her family to and go to Six Flags. Yeah, she's on her way back home this morning. I talked to her. But then they're her. headed up north. <laughs> yep. And she'll, they have one night in their own beds and then they're. They're going up to the Stadium of Fire, yep. like she told you guys. And then you're staying in town, hanging out, yes, babysitting the I'm dogs. I'm babysitting all the dogs. Um, yeah. in fact, I, I, uh was with the um all of Lindsay's dogs and stuff oh okay <clears throat> and, oh uh, yeah did and that so, start last night or? yeah okay. yeah they they all left um uh, and, Brandon and all the kids left to go up to Idaho they're yeah, really excited it's just crazy and stuff and um and so I get to go hang out doggy with all sit. oh I've been doggy set and I, I dog set for um, my best friend, Kathy. She had yeah. uh, some things that she had to take care of out of town. And she mm. has six little dogs. Yeah. And now you would think I would have got a lot of stitching done. But, but no. It's like, it's like babies. But it's babysitting <laughs> these six little dogs. And, and cats. She has both. Yeah, she has <laughs> dogs and cats. Well, one cat that is huge. Um, <laughs> but she also has a swimming pool. And I'm not gonna lie, you can't cross stitch and swim at the same time. Well, Jody does. Does she? Yeah, stitching with Ocala, <laughs> she'll take pictures of her in the floaty, and I'm like, dude, that's I, awesome. I, yeah, I don't know if I could. Do or that. by, I don't know if she's in the floaty, but I've seen her post pictures by the pool, and I'm like, that is awesome. But, <laughs> oh man, it was so nice because um, she lives down in Mesquite, and um, we're only about thirty minutes from Mesquite, but mm -hmm. there's like a five to ten uh, degree difference. Yeah, and so it is so hot down there and it's it's like the devil's throat <laughs> down there i'm not kidding it's like so and so i'm not ready for that <laughs> i uh i was able to hang out in the pool kind of mid-morning and then oh, nice. a little bit in the afternoon because it would be so hot but um 
So yeah, I didn't get much That's stitching funny. done. Yeah, I, so. I got a lot of dog loving. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited. I'm my boyfriend is coming to town tomorrow and I get to meet his son and I'm really excited. He has a two year old. And then I'm gonna have him meet mom and John. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank Hi, you, Ellen. Ellen. Thank you so, so much. Sweet. Thank you. Um, and then me and him are headed up to his parent his parents' house. They have a cabin um up north, like a couple hours. And we're just going to hang out in that little town and do their, like, parade and fireworks and barbecue oh, and just hang fun. out. So I'm excited to spend, like, our first holiday together. It's going to oh, be so fun. It's going to be fun. <laughs> yeah. I told him he can't watch Foss, too. But he, <laughs> I was like, he's so funny. He's like, good luck. Every time I get ready in the morning and we FaceTime because we're three hours apart, uh, like, three hours away from each other. And I get ready with him, and it's so funny. He's like, good luck on Floss, too. But I'm like, you're so funny. <laughs> I'm like, you can't watch. <laughs> oh, let's see. Uh, you dog set. Like, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I, You know, and I don't do it as much as I used to. Now I I have John in my life. Yeah, but. But it is fun. To and see to, all of to them. To see all of them. And, yes. you know, I, I just love them. Yes. I love the dogs. Awesome. So, cool. Anyway. Well, I think we everyone is finally here. So yeah, we are going to go started. over what was in our newsletter. So the very first thing we came out with, um, so we released I Would Rather Be Stitching, the pin pack. So here's the chart. The pillow is actually at StitchCon. It should be back here soon. And so we just released the pin pack individually. So you get the three bees and the spool in the pin pack sold separately. It's just by itself. You'll have to buy the pattern, your cloth, yeah. um, floss pack Very separately. Um, so that is new in the shop. We're going to start carrying all our pin packs um, going forward. And then me and Katie curated this. I think oh this is gosh, my favorite it's bee bundle so we've done. Pretty. I it's love just how like, soft it is. Yes, it's a soft combination Look at of that. the grays, really? the Look blues, and the yellows. And me and her had so much fun picking this out. So is these, so this is pretty. a limited edition bundle. It's ten pieces. Some of these fabrics are over a year, like they're a year old, so we can't get, get them. Yeah. Um. So and pretty. I think this bundle is just perfect for well, our there's so many there's such small prints yeah, that so they would be limited so good. quantity yeah. they'd be good for all your really small yeah. stitches i even thought a topper to put oh, under all your bead display absolutely. like this would be beautiful just as patchwork okay. and a mini patchwork a runner to put okay. on your display to back your pillows. I love this one. Look how that's like a the square yeah, like and a square a, or something. Yes. It's really And a pretty. lot of these are like Lori Holt, they're yeah. basics, they're Deb like Strain. Um, I'm trying to think of who else. Like Riley Blake and Moda Fabrics are the majority. I'm pretty sure but all very, of these are. But very soft. I love just how yeah. soft they it are. It was such a fun bundle to pick. I, I'm so proud of us. We did that one together. That it was so really fun. really pretty. I love that one. Yes. And then we um, officially have released all of our Nashville except the North Pole. So all of our Nashville charts are now PDF. So our last one was Raindrop Kisses. I wanted to show them all to you guys. Yeah. Um, and then Snowman 2023. Fresh Lemonade. Perfect Hot Cocoa. So all these are PDF. Oh You're able gosh. to get them as a yeah. digital download now. The Christmas quilt. And um, do we have kits in so restored? So we are stock? releasing the finishing kit for Christmas quilt in Christmas in July. We are also releasing Snowman 2023 finishing kit with the board mm. in Christmas in July. So these Ooh. two finishing kits are going to be available next month. So keep an eye out. We have tons of good Christmas coming, you guys. I, I'm going to be sewing <laughs> like insane. And then rather be stitching the finishing kit we are done with, but you can get that pin pack. All of these have floss packs you can purchase. Ah, uh, thank you, Patricia. I'm going to go back and read comments, like, because we don't have our iPad in front of us today. Yeah. Seasonal sampling winter and spring, which Lindsay's been working on summer. I know a lot of you guys have asked. And then the hot cone Christmas chair. 
So all of those are available as a PDF download. Um, go get those if you haven't, if you're international and you've been waiting patiently. I'm so sorry it's taken us this long. Um, it's just been, it's just been a lot and getting that sip and stitch ready has been a lot, but so fun. And I, I can update you guys. So the sip and stitch for 2023, the very first one this year is finally coming this July. Yeah. Uh, we don't have a date nailed down, but mid July is what it's looking like. The mugs shipped today. And then it is go time. We are going to yeah. be hustling all our butts to get those boxes ready for you guys. So mark your calendar. July you guys aren't gonna miss is the sip one. and stitch, the very first one this year. Um, I think this is it's the an one, exclusive box. This one is going to be. It's my favorite. The, we have the put biggest and most our heart and soul in this thing, you guys. So this sip and stitch has had everyone's hands in it with primrose and outside of us has helped us there is exclusive things in there that um we've never done there is so much good in this box and you guys are gonna love it yeah. um so that's coming out this july we're gonna nail down a date once i get tracking on that uh for the mugs and it is go time yeah like I'm so excited. We're so excited to get this to you guys. Mm. And I'm sorry for the delay. We did have like um, a printing issue with our mug, but everything is here but that mug and the mug shipped today. So yeah. sip and stitch coming out this July. It's gonna happen. We will nail down a date and as soon as we know that date, it's gonna be posted all over our social media, in the newsletters, like, yeah. so just keep that in mind. Keep an eye out on Instagram. We have a Facebook group. Like just, I, I cannot wait for you guys to see it because yeah. it has been a lot of love, a lot of work, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears, but it is coming. <laughs> I'm so it's excited. Be fun. It will be, it will be fun <sighs> to see all you guys be excited about it. Um, so the next thing in our newsletter we did, um, which I didn't put this in the newsletter, but I got a text this morning from my dad and he is releasing the welcome to the North Pole. He is doing a batch of the board. So the present frame is released and sold by my dad, Jim Moore. It's more men made on Etsy. There will be links in the description after. It's for this walnut finishing board. It's going to be released July 6th at noon. And it's a batch. It's just one batch. I'm not sure how many while supplies last and then he will start working on the next batch so mm -hmm. if you've been waiting to get this finishing board i would literally set your alarm on your phone and be ready to add that to cart and check out if you want it because they go quick mm -hmm. so you can still get the chart the floss pack and i was going to show them the pin pack and me and katie released a tutorial on youtube and instagram on how to place your pins or your buttons for this so go check that out. Yeah. Um, yeah. Because we've had a lot of people ask. So we posted it in our group. We posted it on Instagram. And we posted it on YouTube. Mm -hmm. Fat Quarter Shop is following along. They have charts, floss, and buttons too. So. I, I just wanted to yeah. comment. I, I'm sorry. We, we don't have anybody to. I know. I'm to, sorry. No one's read. leaking. Because yeah. everyone's out of town. Yeah. It's that time but of year. But I just wanted to say. Um, yes. Uh, Debbie. I can't wait to go to Cocoa Beach. Oh, and, and meet everybody there. Yes. I am so excited. I actually been like surfing to find any other retreats that oh. I might want to go to. Yes. I want to go to. I wanted to go to another one this year. Or do one this mm -hmm. year. But. Gosh, I got so many trips already planned know, and everything and, and stuff. But it's just interesting how they're all in Florida. Like all these all these retreats are yep. down in Florida. I need to have some come this way. Well, I was talking <laughs> to my best friend, Sam, and me and her were thinking of booking a retreat mm. together. And I said, let's try and do the... Is it Stitch West that's in Utah? Yes. So I think me and Sam might try and go to that. I don't know yet. My best friend. The one that they're doing, this next one's full. It is. So it's they probably have a wait out. list maybe. Yeah. But um, I'm like, we need to go to one together because I've gotten her into the stitching. And I'm like, it'd yeah. just be fun to do no, that. I, well, me and my sister are, we, uh, we are going um, 
Not to, come to the Annabellas. Yeah, yes. I, we're going to the Cocoa Beach one in April. And so mm -hmm. that is a little far away. But um, I, I've i been surfing and trying to, I really want to go to a Teresa Kogut one. I, oh, and I you better really, get on it because she announced mm, that she is taking a break after all these. Like, and so, I don't know. Yeah. I, I'm going to be surfing. So if you guys have <laughs> any suggestions, pop them in there because yes. I really want to go. Um to a couple more and uh, mm -hmm. because they are so fun to connect with all you guys. So oh, yes. anyway, but um, um, next, so, in <laughs> next in the newsletter. Next in the newsletter, we did a last call for Patriotic. So we do have some of our bright trim Ooh, packs left for your nice. finishing. It has ribbons, rickrack and palm for you to finish an assortment of those. And then I wanted to just, these are kind of last call patriotic. We'll just, this is how our bundles kind of come. The bundles come like this once once we package them. So last call, we are done pa with patriotic. There's no more after this. So we have this one here that has, Yeah. you won't be able to see, but yeah. we do have a lot of, you'll want to go in um, and. Just go check it out. Yeah, I, we linked it in the newsletter yeah. to all the bundles. Lots of good ones left. Ooh, this one's a good one. A lot um, of fun A lot bundles. of these kind of coordinate together, so you could use it for quilting. Yeah. You could definitely um, finish your cross stitch, your backer boards, your yeah. pillows. There's this. Oh, this one. This one was a. Yeah. They're all just beautiful. Um, very beautiful. And these are two different like truck ones that coordinate mm -hmm. together. So fun. So, yeah. We had so much fun curating Patriotic this year. <laughs> um, the next one's going to be Halloween. They're going to go crazy. I know. <laughs> we have so much Halloween fabric, and it's so good. Yeah. I can't wait. And I wanted to let them know. Um, so we released a tutorial for our fresh lemonade, which Allie, is it Allie that's doing a stitch along Stitch the Lemons, mm. I think? I so this so. had sold out, but we are doing a restock event. Like everything's on order to do a restock for this finishing kit, nice. which includes the fabrics, the clothespin, the two pins, the twine, twine, and your wool that you attach. So that's coming back in stock soon for you guys. Go check out that tutorial that we posted on how to finish it, and. And then, I need to stitch that and do that yeah. one. <laughs> and then um, this was the last week with the uh, stitch, stitch, with, along with Mom. stitch along with mom. Thank you so much for everyone oh who my joined. Gosh. Thank you. It was so fun to do. Yeah. Um, I I'm gonna really I try see. to finish f or do a fully finish, yeah. but I got it all done. So beautiful. It it, it turned out really pretty. And this one's called pretty. Stacy Nash, uh, pretty in pink pen yeah. keep. Mom stitched it on 28 count wheat, which we're out of stock right now, but we have it on back order. Yeah. It's also... It, it really turned out beautiful. Um, we still have patterns and floss packs if you still want to uh, grab one. And then we won't be restocking, obviously, the floss packs. So once that's gone, that's gone. But yeah. I'm going to... I think what I want to do is... I think I'm going to frame this one. Um, but I, I want to tell you guys, I know the ones that... The one that she showed on the pillow or it's a pillow. And when we seen it at market, it was done on linen. I'm not sure yeah. what count Here, I a linen, see what it says. but it's on linen. And it's on 35 count dames of the needle. And so linen, it was dirty, really ew. small, which it was, was beautiful, tiny, really tiny. Um, so mine did turn out a little bigger because of yeah. the count. And so I just picture this in a really pretty antique frame. Yes. And, um, it and just so, looks like it reminds me of Jane Austen. It reminds yeah. me of that time period, yeah, and it does. has all those beautiful aspects of quilting and cross yeah. stitch. Like I just love it. But like up here, there's quite a bit of space right here. You could put like and your so initials or I'm, something. I'm thinking I might either do my initials That's in the year idea. or something like that, yeah. or I might just do another heart or I don't know. I, I it just. It was a little blank for me right there, so I'm gonna do something. Yeah. Not quite sure, but I I do. I wanna I wanna see if I can hunt me down like an antique frame yeah. or something. I think would just really be pretty. So cute. So, I love it. Yeah. And then we had some new charts from designers 
Um, really quick, I want to show um, Hands On Design. So she came out with a few new charts. The Pocket Neighborhood is one by Hands On Design. These are so cute. The Strawberry, the Berry Basket. And then a Vintage Stitch, which I love this. I already, I already got me one of these. Yes. So those are in stock. This one is out of stock, but I just reordered. The floss pack um, was sold separately and she collaborated with Color and Cotton. And they are sold out, both the chart and floss pack in our shop, but it, it, it is on back order. The floss packs are out of stock from Color and Cotton, but it's, I will be notified when that's back in stock and I will yes. get more on order for you guys. Which I think these are so cute. Yes. Um, I love those. You're and then cute. Tiny Modernist released a Stitcher's Heart, which I think is so I cute. Grabbed, I grabbed me one of these too. I love I that. love this one. I just I love What does it say? It's uh, a Stitcher's Heart is ever full when needles pieces when needles pierce and pierce threads, and threads pull. pull. I just thought that was so cute. Yes. Reminded me of me and my sister's stitching. So this one's in <laughs> stock. Um, the Ornament Series Part 1 of 4. Um, it's Halloween Spooktacular. Cute. And these would be great to stitch up for a double. It looks and like... It, look, there's piece, there's, actually, there's, gonna there's be more parts. Are they already out or that's um, going to be more? I'd have to look. Because this is one of part four. Part 1 of 4. So it's the so. first one that's released. Um, and the, like Oh, it's okay. Look, yeah, show them the back. Look at the back. I don't know if you can see that. So that's so cute together, or you could split it up. I love Tiny Modernist. Okay. Oh, and then man. I kit that this one so up, cute. the Queen Bee, or the Bee Queen. So I did kit, end up kitting this, and I picked my cloth. I think I picked the 32 Light Taupe. Are you sticking with the colors? Yes, I did. I'm going to do all called for. I'm doing on 32 count Light Taupe, which we have all of our taupes on back order. It's pretty. It's all DMC. Wow. And she has a witch one too that I want that I have kit as well. And it is big, but that's why I'm doing it on the 32 count and I'm going to do one over two. And wow, that's pretty. That's going on my gallery wall. Like I can't wait. And then heartstring samplery, we got the sting back in stock which I have this started. I already did float, which float and sting went together. And then I wanted to show you guys how cute. These are called her Festive Little Fogs. She has different editions. So this is stitching. This is this is really cute. There's a springtime. They're just time. teeny. They're just like little smalls. Yeah, and I love them. And I'm going to, I started one. You know, and it, it what's so Americana. nice about these little smalls is they're so you get them done fast. In a day. You can get them done in a day. Do a couple, you know, do a few all week and then one week do all your finishes. Yes. And stuff. And their coffee one, which I oh bought because mom, I, I, I was like, mom, this one's yours. I got this one. I'm going to, I'm going to have to do some yeah. kidding on that because and then oh my gosh, I did I a that. seaside, which I had started one and I wanted to show you guys to oh. add to my seaside. If you guys are following along, I'm doing a seaside section in my house. I picked the crab to do, and I'm doing all the same floss as my oh, tiny that's town. Just teeny. So my tiny town, which these are in stock, tiny town seaside floss packs in stock. Mm. So she and did the little I crab. I kitted this, and I started the crab, and it has an initial, so I was gonna do the E in my birth year, and I'm gonna try and do most of these. So what is that on? That's this really one small. is thir or 28 count mushroom. Oh, that's not bad. Is it one over two or two over two? I did two. I did two over two. Cute. And that's really um, small. That is all the same called Ooh, for floss see? as my tiny town. Look at that. You guys could get all those little tinies and you'd be set for the rest yes. of the summer. There you go. They're so cute. I, I wonder. Them. I bet she comes out with a Christmas one. Yeah. I that think she cool. might have one. I don't think I have all of those in stock. They're really cute. 
They're but really I just thought cute. we've been just so into the doll bowl thing right now. And I'm like, this is perfect. Well, and they've been like, I've been noticing on Instagram and everywhere how everybody's been doing their little setup with, you yeah. know, I think, I think everybody's been inspiring e each other about oh, yeah. how they've been doing their doll bowls. And I was going to tell you guys, so there's one, two, three, four, there's like five of them on here that are the same size. Mm -hmm. And I thought I could do four of them and do four and do a patchwork topper type thing. Mm. Like patch it together yes. like you've talked about with your yeah. Lori Holt. Mm -hmm. So I have thought that. I just haven't decided there you how go. I'm going to do that. So it's all a work in progress. <laughs> yeah, nice. But um, I think that's it. We can show our whips if you want, Mom. Um, well, like I say, I didn't get much done. I mean, okay. I, I did a little bit on a little things here and there but yeah. not enough to really say oh I did something yeah so I did you know of course I worked like crazy to get that yes. done and then I'm I'm kind of on the oh, home I love I'm, those. I'm oh. on the home stretch of this and so I just can't put it down now but look I just have fill in Koget. it's Teresa Koga I do believe we have them in stock I I don't oh here let me see if I, I think I have the pattern but this I think it's called Needle and Flax. Yeah. And then it was a Nashville Needlework yeah. market release. I absolutely and she, have loved this. I'm doing all the called for yeah. colors. I love the colors that she picked. It and is that's the so, 20, that looks like the 28 count light taupe. Or yeah. is that 27 count Linda? I'm, I'm thinking 27. I think this is Linda. So I think that's the light taupe Linda. Yeah, and I think it's... Because I feel I, I can feel the Linda feels different than the Lugana. But you guys, it has been so fun. I just have to do the fill in, um, put the pins in the pin cushion, and oh my gosh. And I don't know. I might even buy me some cute little regular pins to put in there. It's so, so it shows cute. to do like a stitch, you, you know. But I think if I turn this into a pillow. Like a heart or a spool yeah. or something yeah. would be really cute. So I'm, I just, I have absolutely loved doing this. Yeah. And I can't wait to do. My, my next one that I'm going to start though is she's got like the bunnies. Um, yeah. Like the Mr. and Mrs. Bunnies and yes. different things. I I am just. I think it's called it Love bit. Is Key, which yeah. we have that in stock. I I've been biting it the bit to start one of her bunny ones, yeah. but um, I you know I joined her Patreon and oh, yeah. loaded all the stuff that that she offers to Patreon uh, to prescribers, yes. and I could be stitching for the rest of my life. I could mm -hmm. be stitching in. My, She's very generous in I my like. afterlife. Yeah, <laughs> Because I've got, I've got plenty of patterns. I feel that. And um, <laughs> I think that will be awesome. Yes. So, and yeah. then I worked on my Seaside Tiny Town. Like I said, if you go to my Instagram, yeah, so I have my display ready. And I'm trying to hurry and stitch everything. And I started my next section. Oh, look at that. And it's just the houses. And um, I already finished this one. Oh I just gosh, need to add the eyeballs. so cute. And then I finished, you know, this one. I'm doing all different colors. And then I plan on putting it in my display. So cute. How cute And I'm that just is. like, that's what I've been kind of focused on right now is trying to get that all done because I really am excited about my display. I've posted pictures and updates. I'm very much a work in progress like I'll have my display ready and then I kind of add yeah. everything as I go and it's like by yeah. the end of the time the season it's like all right it's time to put this away even though <laughs> I got it all figured out yeah well and my problem is is what I found when I was away watching the dogs is I wasn't in my comfy zone oh yeah you know yeah. I mean last night um or I got home yet yesterday late afternoon and yeah. I was really tired but it's like I wanted to set and stitch, and it was like, oh, I, I just felt like I was That's, I was yeah. home in my in my comfy zone in in my stitch area yeah. and everything, and it's like I didn't want to go anywhere. Yeah. I just wanted to stitch. Yeah. So once you once you get in your when in your mojo and where you are, yes, I I can just whip it out yeah. and stuff. So, yeah. but yeah. Was that all? Oh, that's all okay, I had. So I, worked I mean, on everyday things because Katie oh, motivated me. I need to work on mine too. I'm gonna finish this. It's on the home stretch. I finished the house, oh. and now I'm getting the border in and all the little stuff. 
We did our own color conversion. Let's see if I can. Um, this was our start with our girls trip this year. So yeah, I need um, to work on mine. I and, have it in my cute bag that we had yeah. made by Como. Yeah. Um, I just keep ordering those bags. I know. <laughs> I've got so many bags now, uh, and I used to not be that way. But I, I told, I told Jess, I says. I'm a bag hoarder now. Is that a bad thing? And she says, no, you can never have too many. No, I love bags, water bottles, and, then, and quilts. Yes, <laughs> yes. and she uh, she actually posted um, today what's going to be dropping in her shop tomorrow. I'm just like, oh, my gosh. Oh, that's funny. I, and, and then I have to have a, I, I have to have a little, uh, what is it? A, a little thing. You got a fobs. A little fobs. Or, and, you know, something to put on the pole. zipper pole. And so I've enlisted my little grandson, uh, Katie's little boy, yeah. to make me a whole bunch. I told him, I says, I'll pay you. Which I think are so satisfying. And yeah. I, I just love them. And and so now that's what I do is everywhere I go, I'm like, going, yeah. oh, that would be a cute little pole. A little, because yes. who don't need bling bling on your bags? Right? I, need I love making the jewel ones. They're so fun. Yeah. They're so easy and satisfying. We need to get more supplies for it because yeah. we ran out. I, I just, uh, I love them. I love them. Um, so I did a full finish this last weekend on Sunday. We were at the shop hanging out, and I did Stitch Card P. I did the sewing machine by Lori Holt. So these are in stock. We have all her oh. stitch cards. And I did my own colors, and then I was like, I'm just going to wing this. And I just did a scrappy pillow, picked two fabrics, and stuffed it. I stitched mine on 32 count. Light taupe, one over two. I used color and cotton and DMC. And I just kind of did that improv stitching. I didn't have a plan. Um, the blue and the red and are from color. So the blue, red, and pink are color and cotton. And then the grays were DMC. Mm -hmm. And the blue is the same one that I'm stitching in A Stitcher's Garden by Tiny Modernist. And the red. The pink yeah. I had picked out. It's not in the chart. It's so cute. And then I posted all the details um, of the fabrics I used and stuff. And it was so fun. I don't know where I'm putting this. It doesn't match anything in my house. But I was like, this is cute. But you know what? When you do yeah. get your sewing I'm corner. I'm getting a shish in <laughs> yeah. one day. When, when you get your little sewing corner, yes. you just put it up so, and poke a couple of pins in there. Yeah, so this was yeah. so fun. I filled it up with the polyfill and the polyfill pellets. Um, which we'll be getting the poly pellets in stock for you guys soon. And it's just so fun. And I wanted to sh tell them too. So we were blown away by you guys once more. We sold out of these. <laughs> but I ordered more in their till. They're like this color. And Ooh. so there's more on the way, but this color. And this is a point turner. And that's, if you watch our tutorials, we use well, this. Well, I'm going to have to have a blue one, I know. Too. So I ordered the blue one. <laughs> and you use it to point out. You know what you do is you need one for your sewing room. And then you need one for the go. Yeah. You when need, it has a yeah, keychain Yeah, because hook. it has it. You can put a keychain yeah. hook on there. So you need one for your sewing room. And yes. one on the go. Because who goes to the sewing retreats yeah. or, or anywhere or stitching yeah. and you might have Or your something. travel bag, yeah. you know. And another thing I got on order, we use a lot of our pinking shears. Mm. So I ordered some pinking shears too. And I wanted to see if that was something you guys were interested in. Because that's what we use to cut our wool yeah. for to attach the back. I know that there are some rotary cutters um, that do that, that yeah. do that too. And I can order that too. And, and <clears throat> but I'm not sure if they fit what yeah. blades they fit but, on those. Yeah. <clears throat> but anyway, so yeah. So that's that's it, right? That's for it on stitching. the stitching. So you guys yes. are just rocking the stitching world, yes. I tell you. <laughs> that's amazing. So one of the things So quilting, quilting comes out tomorrow. Mm -hmm. um, and we're having last call in there too for our the, this is the Firework oh, Frenzy the quilt fire, kit we still have in stock the, for Patriotic. So we this should is, have brought it out. I know. No. You have both. I don't have this. One. I don't know where that is. One of the girls uh, might have snagged it. I think it. we it's gave the fire, it to it's someone. It's the Firecracker one. It's, yeah. the, it's the Firework Frenzy firework quilt frenzy. kit. Still in stock. Yes. And, <clears throat> um, and then we have... Yes. 
the this is the window, window pane, pane which the mom posted a picture it's so oh pretty oh my gosh i took some pictures of yeah. it in my backyard and it turned out so and it's Teresa beautiful Kogut fabrics. yes so that, pretty i'm just so in love with this fabric in fact i have yeah. <clears throat> i do have a bundle of this that yes. i will be saving to do something yes. with it again it's so cute that oh my gosh you guys this this is a must to have for the fourth yeah. of july it's so pretty it's so americana if you are into the americana colors yes. this is the That's quote it. for you and it is it's easy to do yeah. um it's a fun one to yes. do but um did you want to hit on the needle minders yes yeah, so someone asked about the needle minders so they we had um a little bit of an issue so they are on hold and we will announce yeah. it's but when i at the be beginning of this video weeks. i told you guys it's been a lot lately yes. of learning with our yeah. growing we've grown in a way we weren't expecting and we're learning how to do it yeah because and none we, of us know what we're doing well, and we and um we so had we had to, a hiccup yeah and so it's coming there just there was a little bit of a hiccup so we're just waiting on yeah. something so. Yeah. So, but they are coming yeah. and, and there's going to even be more. <laughs> so, yeah. um, we're just learning how to deal with, uh, the growth, the the growth, growth. Yeah, of it's... things and, and the protocol and how you order things and how you get things made and, and yes. everything. And believe me, when we started this seven years ago, we would have never thought of yeah. That would any be of this. Carrying like merchandise, yes. basically, which yeah. we have shirts available. Yes, still. we still have. The I shirt. have the navy on. I have the the rose, rose colored one yes. on, and I've washed it. I've not dried it, but yeah. Lynn, I've dried, has dried and it's them. It's been fine. Been great. Um, so. The other thing in quilting, we have free pattern Friday for Ooh. July kits released, which limited quantity. We won't be able to restock. So yes, this is the kit. This. It's gonna. And I get to go home and sew this. Yes. So it has three of the little mini, the mini little charm packs. Yep. It's got this color here. And this is called uh, Sun Washed by Cory Yoder from Moda Fabrics, oh my gosh. which we love our Cory Yoder. Look at this. Look at you guys. Oh my gosh. So this is a limited quantity free pattern Friday. It's actually a little less than what we normally do. Um, so definitely grab that if you want it because once it's sold out, yeah. we won't be doing a restock on it. So it's going to have three yeah. of the little minis. Yes. And then your backings always vary with our kids. Mm -hmm. um, we just pick a coordinating fabric. and So they'll be in the so newsletter cute. tomorrow. Yeah. So you guys, like she says, if there's limited quantities, you're yeah, going to want to grab has one. Yeah, probably the least amount we've had so far because of how many charms it takes. Yeah. So it kind of downsized the amount of kids, but yeah. And Debbie, okay. mom, mom and I are twinning. twinning. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Yep. So, definitely... so you guys will have to grab that. That's yeah. something you're a must. Yes. And I can't wait to go home and get it sewn. I get to... I, I haven't sewn for almost a week now. Oh, I'm, okay. I'm having withdrawals. withdrawals. I, Which that is my, <clears throat> I, I love sewing in the morning. Yes. I'm a, so, I'm a morning I would, sewer. That's for sure. And I love to sew until about two o'clock and then, yeah. And then I'm good to cross stitch. Which I, my boyfriend's coming and I bought a sewing table. My mom was like, Ooh. she gave me her sewing machine. Yeah. And so I bought a sewing table and my boyfriend's going to help me build it. I'll post updates like oh, on Instagram nice. and stuff. Very nice. And I was like, honey dues while you're here. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> but he's awesome. He's like, I have no problem. And That's awesome. so he's going to help me build it so I can get sewing. I picked out um, a quilt I showed you guys last week for me and him. I'm going to have it like on his bed at his house. Mm -hmm. And then I have the seaside a bundle I took so I want to do my finishes at home for my seaside nice. and so I'm like ah it's so close yeah. I <laughs> ordered me um you know a few months ago we talked about uh me and Lindsay bought a new we both bought us a new Bernina sewing machine oh yeah oh my gosh I absolutely love it and that's what I, we use we use oh, Bernina for I our use Bernina's machines. um yeah. I know there's several different brands out there that are just amazing and awesome mm -hmm. my my best friend she loves the fobs or whatever they're called and, oh okay and, see uh, I've only used the Bernina and, uh, and uh, it, but like I grew butter. up <laughs> I grew up with Singer and Bernina yeah and I had my mom's very first Singer um sew machine and yes. um and then I have her Bernina that she bought 
years after mm -hmm. and um i actually gave that to katie yeah and so katie has my Grandma's, my mom's i have and, yours Lindsay and then, or jesse just got Lindsay's. Lindsay's and then me and Lindsay and now we all got, have we all have, have our, our own sewing machines and so, so. i am so excited but i actually um so in my other machines um brandon uh would build the tables and, and like he cut would he would cut the top out to where I could sink my machine. Yeah. Well in my home with John I don't have a table. I just have a little like folding like a little folding table. Yeah. And so my machine is lifted. And um and so I ordered me it's one of the big attachments that go on to the machine and it's like a big oh, table attachment. Interesting. And I love to see I'm that. so excited they called yesterday and they said it was in. So I'm going to go pick that Ooh, up. Yeah, so I, go I bought home. on Amazon. I can link it when I do my Instagram stories about it. It was only like $180. It's a cheap little Amazon sewing machine table um, and it does have the sink in thing. Mm -hmm. Because I do think that is helpful if you can have a space for your sewing machine. I like it sunken. So what that means is your sewing machine is flush with the table. Yep. So it's easier to sew instead of above and like off. I don't know how yeah. else to explain I was going to see if I could. Um, but I'll link it. And mom, I can show. If you yes. want, I could show you how to link. And mom can link hers when it comes to show you guys what she got. Yeah. Because... Having your the correct tools, the correct oh, space, everything it just helps so having much. Having an ironing table, I like was gonna, it just makes things flow. Your workspace, yeah, flow easier, and that's why I finally broke down because I haven't had a sewing machine at my house because I'm like I just don't have. I didn't. I want to be comfortable, so that's why I broke down yeah. and bought a sewing table. I oh here it is. I took a picture. Let's see. So it, that's what it... That's my new one. Okay, so it's... Oh, for the brand? Yeah. So it's a Bernina um, Outliers a, Edition B475. It's a Quilter's Edition. It's the Quilter's Edition. It's B475. Oh, Quilter's. Yeah, it's a Quilter's Edition. Oh, God, I did not yeah. read that right. Yeah, Quilter's it's Quilter's Edition. edition. It's uh, number B475. And Bernina. Bernina. Yeah. I have to say, I absolutely love it. It um, it has your self cutting. It has um, <clears throat> the bobbin's bigger. It, the bobbin said. is bigger. It's yeah. like double the size of a normal bobbin. And so, like, I am yeah. not kidding. I can sew forever. Yes. And and then it just has so many so many bells and whistles that yeah. is just bur just beautiful yes. machine. I absolutely recommend yes. it. And, um, anyway, so I can't wait. Yeah. I'll have, to, when I get it all set up, maybe yeah. I'll have to, have do to a, link it. Yeah. yeah. I'll do um, it. Um, which we actually, my goal, since I have more time and I'm not in there very often is to set up an Amazon storefront. So mm -hmm. that is something I want to work on for you guys. So you guys can grab things from Amazon that we also yeah. like. And oh, I'm always... You know, the one thing I've been trying to find and I cannot find anywhere in town what? is, I don't have one, but they're the rings. They're the, 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 the oh, rings. Oh, the rings. I get that, it from the dollar store. That, that unlock. Yes. Really? The dollar store. Go I to the dollar. Family. Everywhere. Not family dollar. Dollar Tree. Oh. And they're, it's in their, um, like their office area. Mm -hmm. They have the rings like this. Mom's talking about these. Well, they they unlock. Are you talking about these? Yes. So these, she's I talking can't about find, these, and I don't want them that big. No, they're not. This is a big one we got from um, Checker, so we order from Checker. Yeah. Um, they're a size smaller at yes. the Dollar Tree oh. in the section of the office supplies. Okay. Yeah, because I even tried to order some online, and I got this bag of because I prefer rings, mine, and gloss they don't like open. That. They're they're like a keychain ring, and yeah. I'm like, I can't use that. And Amazon, <gasps> someone just, I think Amazon too. Um, but I, yeah, I just have to find which ones. And yeah, so, yeah. Which I prefer my floss on one of those because Me too. it's so nice to grab it instead of looking in my bag for them yeah. all spread out. Yeah, I I agree. I hate the whole I, mess. I've <laughs> switched to that for yeah. sure. 
So and bobbinating. But someone asked if our shirts are available. Yes, yes. you can still get these yep. limited quantity once they're sold out. They're out. Um, don't forget that on July sixth. July 6th at noon, my dad is releasing a batch of the frame for the North Pole. Yeah. On July 6th at noon, more men made. I will link it below. Yeah. And then um, Sip and Stitch is coming out in July. Sip and Stitch is coming out in mm -hmm. July. <laughs> and real quick, not, I'm sorry. One yeah. more thing, because you guys are such wonderful uh, people to direct us in the direction we want. Yeah. <laughs> I want, and I've been wanting to buy a featherweight, one of the old uh, senior featherweights. Yes. And I've been researching them. There's, in our time, yeah. There is tons. There, there is tons of them out there, but I don't want to. Um, I don't want to buy the wrong one. Like, I can see them, like, on the marketplace where people are refurbishing them and everything. Oh, and I'm, okay. like, going, do I trust that? Do I spend the money and trust that? Or do I go and I spend the huge amount of money? Oh, and geez. so let me know, you guys, in the comments of yeah. anything about what your recommendations for a featherweight is. I, <coughs> I really, me and my sister, we've been um, looking at them. And yeah. I really would like to try one and to buy one. But I just... I don't want to buy one and go, dang, that was a waste of money Oh, I've, and yeah. stuff. So I figure you guys would be my best, yeah. my best. Uh, or if you know someone yeah, that If you know somebody selling, that sells them and, them and you know that they are awesome and wonderful, um, yeah. let me know. I, I, someone said they bought one made in their birth year. That's a good idea. Oh, wouldn't that be awesome? Well, you know, years ago, well, when we first started the business, and I'm kicking myself for this right now. We were quilting for a gal <laughs> that refurbished them. And if you're out there, let me know. Because she offered to do trade work and oh, let us quilt yeah. her quilts and she would trade with us. Well, at the time, we were like, you know, we we're like, well, we're just so new. We need to pay this machine off. Yeah. <laughs> and so we're like, eh, not right now. And now we're kicking ourselves because I don't remember who it was. Lindsay has tried and tried to figure out in her brain mm. of who it was. And... Yeah. We couldn't find, we can't find her. And, and that, so yeah. I would love to buy one. I just, I just want to make sure I buy yeah. the, a good one and that it's what I want. Yeah. So, but anyway. <clears throat> Sweet. So, yeah, check out our newsletter. It's been fun. I have giveaways to announce Ooh. and more to give away. So, definitely, giveaways are US only. You need to comment in the comments after this video not the live and comment um, whether you want quilting or stitching mm -hmm. giveaway or both. Um, so last week we did, for two stitchers, we did cream 25 count Ooh. along with a Hank chicken club and stackable March. Which would probably be plenty of cloth to do both. Yeah, business. so Glenna Ger, uh, Grider, G I R A R D I E R is one. Very the nice. other winner is Maureen Lopez. Will you put that sticky on there? Yes. And then the um, quilting was these two patterns. One is a Christmas book, ho ho ho, Ooh. and then the thimble blossom. Um, one of them was just G G G I G I. And then the other one was Patty Smith. Very nice. So e in the description will be my email. Email me your address and what you won. You have one week to claim this prize and we will get that shipped to you, US only. Um, so the next week I decided to do stitching is two of these, the Summertime Simply Science and Stackable Ooh. May. Look how cute those are. How and then quilting i did the november and december december barn block mini pattern this or that and then the fabric attic two winners for both of those wow um nice so just comment if you're interested in winning any of those um we love giving you guys away like fat quarter yeah. shop is awesome they send us their patterns oh they and yes. we love to give those to you guys and we try to we have a huge bin of giveaways, so yep. We just add we add in our bin, and, <laughs> and then we we give it all away. Yes. 
So, so we just appreciate you guys so much. Yes, so. we do. Thank you for all the suggestions. I'm yes. going to go back uh, later comments. this afternoon and, and read the comments yeah. and everything. You guys are amazing. I, I knew I could count on you yes. guys. <laughs> but have a safe, happy holiday. Absolutely. Um, and we will be back next week. Um, <clears throat> Floss tube, I, I think, is on schedule. We'll definitely let you guys know. Yep. Newsletters are still going to come out next week. So keep an eye on those. Make sure you get on there and grab all the 4th of July yep. you can. We're, we're done with 4th yep. of July. Um, and Christmas in and July. Christmas starting. in July. You guys get your stitching out. We've yes. got all of our Christmas in July. I'm going to go home and start sewing all the good Christmassy yes. stuff. I'm going to put Christmas music on. How's that? <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, lots of kits, bundles, all sorts of um, finishing kits, lots of Christmas in July coming. So yep. keep an eye out for that. And... You guys are amazing. Awesome holiday. Thanks for joining today. We'll yes. talk to you guys later. Bye guys. Bye. Love you all.